I've been uh, performing robotic surgery for about um, six years now, and I do mostly hysterectomies, myomectomies, um, uh, surgery on the ovaries, endometriosis. In a typical robotic procedure, a patient comes to the operating room is put to sleep. Um, she, the laparoscopic instruments are placed in the abdomen, and then the robot is brought over and attached to the laparoscopic instruments. And afterwards, then I will go into the console and uh, perform the surgery through the console. From a surgeon's standpoint, it's uh, ergonomically easier rather than working on long instruments at which your flexibility and your dexterity is limited to looking in a console where you see it three-dimensionally as opposed to two-dimensionally on a screen and it's in high definition, it's magnified, um, and you have the ability to move these instruments like you would move your natural hands. The newest advance in, in robotic surgery is single site. We can now do the laparoscopy through a single incision through the um, belly button as opposed to multiple incisions. So not only do you get less scarring, but now you can have one scar that's very well hidden. So um, cosmetically, it's, it's really quite pleasing for the patient as well. Robotic surgery allows the patients to recover much quicker. My patients usually go home the same day as opposed to staying in the hospital three days. There's less risk of infection. There's less risk of bleeding or hemorrhage. Uh, the patients have less pain. They require less pain medicine. And they are, can usually go back to work a lot earlier than they otherwise would.